Hello, this is Harker Devin, and today we are going to be going into some uh, liminal spaces. If you like this video, please like on the video, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel. Now let's get right into this. Whatever. Plockton, Scotland. I don't know what a Plockton is. I do know what a Scotland is. Sort of. Oh wow, that's really pretty. That bench really does make it feel like a liminal space. Like if that bench wasn't there, this just this would just be a landscape picture. And that bench really makes it look different. At some park at two AM. Oh, wow. Terrifying. Let's go. <coughs> My favorite Polaroids this year. I love when things don't just don't, don't do what they're supposed to, don't you? But that is beautiful. Nowhere left to go. Yeah, you see, after uh, at the edge of that uh, 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 darkness where it's just like completely dark, it's actually a world border. And after you go there, you, you'll just be falling into the void forever. You should probably avoid uh, going through that. Corporate holiday breakfast. I freaking hate corporate stuff, and this is why. It looks liminal, but that's only because it's so empty and bland and boring. That's what I hate about corporations and them just making places look more and more like offices every single day. Even places that used to be like a place you went for food. That was supposed to be a comfortable dining experience at one time. Now it's just an office and they mostly do drive through shit. Looks like, looks like an enchanted forest. I would imagine walking on this path and being scared to utter any nomenclature whatsoever. That's not a word for names. A, a drive out of Burning Man 2023. Oh wow, so empty and all of those cones really, yeah, it's the, the feeling that there probably were people there at some time. Close intersection. Red lights, yellow lights. Oh yeah, by the way, do not take photos while you're driving. I know OP did here. Like, just in general, it's not a safe thing to do. You can get pulled over for distracted driving or driving with your phone out uh, these days, and that uh, and doing something like this would probably get you pulled over. But not I don't just because you'll get pulled over, but because it's not that safe. I'm gonna fail oh this exam. I mean the chalkboard is really far and they don't let you move your chairs, so obviously you are going to fail this exam. <sighs> Train station at night. Honestly, I've never actually been to a train station in real life. I've never been on a train in real life, so maybe that makes sense. My cat on our roof. Oh, look at the kitty. Such a good kitty. <laughs> Cats are amazing. This is probably the scariest level space. This photo I took, not gonna lie. Yeah, it looks pretty terrifying. 
If those lights were way further away and looked a lot closer together, I, I would actually hate it just because it would look like, like some um, eyes look at me from a very long ways away. I actually hate two lights that are outside my window for that exact reason. But no, there's more to it. Um, the snow or the ice there are really it brings back a lot of memories from when I was younger. City twenty four, mapped by somebody on the Steam Workshop. I don't know what game this is for, but. Making a city game with no people in it, I mean, or a city map with no people in it, it's just begging to be put on the subreddit, basically. Although I'm not sure if the creator actually wanted this to be on this a, a, a sub or to be posted at all. It's here, isn't it? Wow, this is really neat. It definitely belongs on liminal space, I guess. Chairs. Just a whole bunch of chairs in an empty room. Hate it. So much. Should I go outside? Hate that. I hate it so much. They just like set a place, put all the nature there, and, and then they're like, okay, we did it. Now we can have all of our pollution and grossness. And that's it. They don't let nature just be natural. No, it has to follow the rules. And that's BS. Anyway, some old photos I took. Oh. <sighs> the post, my dear. I clicked on open link in it. <sighs> Computer, please. Come along now. I think a little bit of my dislike of corporations is just my dislike of how corporations have basically ruined the world these days in general. Anyway, some old photos OP took. Wow. There's a path with so many trees on either side. I kind of love it because it's so, it's a little bit funny to me, but there's just this one tree here and then the rest is just nothing. It's empty otherwise. Anyway, here's the staircase. Taken in Turkey. I've never heard of this place, but oh wow, that's spooky. Night Street, does this count? I mean, yeah, 
You can barely make out what's going on, but it, I think it counts. The tint of the sky and the emptiness gave off a weird vibe. Yeah, actually, you don't want to go in that, that building. If you went in, you probably would have been sucked into another dimension and of um had to go uh, and you would have had to go through a game show to get out. Just ask Kinger. He knows what I'm talking about. Tunnel underneath a dying mall. Oh gosh, that tunnel looks like a safety hazard. Is it designed that way, or like, is the east ceiling about to cave in? I'm a little bit scared for your life right now, OP. Get out of there. Starting to look like Christmas. Oh my goodness, it is. I'm so jealous. I wish I got snow during Christmas time. But no, I just get cold. It's weird because when I was a kid and I was living in this same area, and I was in this area, it was, it was actually really, really heavy on the snow. <gasps> no comment. I miss him too much. He was like literally my favorite character in that show. Anyway. I don't want to stay here for long. Yeah, looks like the back rooms. Should probably try and find your way out, but... I mean, chances are you're never getting out of there. So just hope you get to the next level where you can probably survive a bit longer. Basement of a gas plant. Hmm. Very eerie and uncanny. Passage. Okay then. Is this liminal to anyone else? Hmm. Not a reason I don't like to do video stuff on this channel is just because. It I mean, just look at that uh, and lag. It is so slow. That's why I usually try to skip the ad stuff. Right, exit. Exit into what? Just darkness. The void. The void is coming in. The void is coming in. The place, OP, you, you better watch yourself, you're walking into the void there. OP, it's starting to get a little bit more voidy out, out there. Starting to worry. Actually, today's weather is not voidy. I'll still do it a bit. I haven't decided if it's gonna go anywhere or not, but you know, it's a fun little bit. Up here. You have been consumed by the void. What even is going on? That's for me to know and for you... Actually, that's not even for me to know. That's for nobody to know and nobody to find out because of what? Yeah, I can't make sense of that either. Right. Old Mall, located in Malaysia. I think this is going to have to be the last one for today. Wow. It's a good last one. Some nice memories. 
That was r slash liminal space. Place full of many, many memories. If you like this video, please leave a like on the video, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel. I have no idea what I'm going to be doing tomorrow, so until then, goodbye!